Guys, I just filmed a makeup tutorial and I'm like listening, I was listening to all these songs and now I've got like 50 million of them stuck in my head. Hello everyone, my name is Paige, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a bit of a different video for you. Didn't get a chance to film anything writing wise this week, so I thought I would do a horse version of a what's in my handbag. So I'm going to show you what's in my writing bag and as you can see one of the things is a whip. But I'm going to show you what's in my writing bag, what brand it is, this might answer a few of your questions about what products I own. And yeah, let's get right into it. Okay, so the first thing that is sticking out of my bag is my dressage whip. Um, I don't typically ride with a crop. Um, if I am going to ride with any kind of extension of the arm, I will ride with a dressage whip just because I think a tap on the shoulder with a crop doesn't really mean anything, so I like to work from the hindquarters. Um, so yeah, I will use this. Um, but this, I don't know what brand it is, but it's just black and sparkly. It's nice and elasticy, I don't know, I really like it. And it's really soft at the end, so it's not going to give your horse any kind of sharp movement. It's great, love it, love it, love it, love it. Good job, camera. Look at you. Okay, stop it. Sorry, I should probably mention the bag that I use as my riding bag is this blue country road bag, and it's just got a over the shoulder strap and normal straps. And yeah, so that's what I keep everything in. It's really big and I think it fits everything really well. And when you open it, it's just one huge compartment. It does have these little pockets on the side, but I don't use them because they're not very secure. Um, but it's just one big rug sack, I suppose, in the inside. When you first open it, apart from the whip, you will see my helmet. Um, this is the Swing Pro Air helmet. And it's in the color navy, but it looks purple because I've had it for so long. And yeah. So it's the Swing Pro Air Helmet. For those of you who might be wondering, I'm pretty sure I'm size 57. Yeah, I'm size 57, so it's quite nice, very breathable, and I have that inside my helmet so I don't lose them. I have my gloves. Um, I will only typically use gloves if it's cold or if I'm on a horse who is quite strong and I don't want to get blisters. Um, Winston, I never usually ride with gloves just because I don't really need it. He's not a strong horse. But horses like Bear and things like that, I might ride with gloves. So use those. Next thing I will always have is a jacket in my bag. The, I have two. I have a blue Katmandu one, which you guys would have recognized from videos. Or I have this black one. This one is my personal favorite. Um, but I always have a jacket in my bag, even if it's hot. You never know. There might be a weather change and you might need a jacket. So I've got that. Um, I always have a spare pair of socks in my riding bag because our school uniform in winter we wear stockings and obviously I can't wear stockings with my horse riding boots so I always need to take some socks after school and sometimes I forget so I always have a spare one of these in my riding bag. The next thing I have is, oops, is a saddle water bag. So this is typically in summer, it kind of doesn't come out during winter, but what you do is you attach it with a little clip to the front of your saddle and you can put a water bottle in it. So that's another thing I usually have in my riding bag. I always have at least two fresh water bottles. Um, so yeah, get quite dehydrated when I ride. But um, no, it's really good, great for summer. Um, I wouldn't recommend using it when you're jumping because it would flap around and kind of make your horse a bit uncomfortable. But if you're just doing some really light work, um, and you're maybe going for a trail ride or something, these are really, really great and I love them. Um, so this is just from, you can get them from pretty much any salary. I don't know what brand it is, but there you go. I have another water bottle because, you know, another water bottle. <laughs> Stay hydrated, my friends. And I have some deodorant. I don't, typically I will use an aerosol deodorant, but I can't because It'll stay in the back of my car, and as we all know, if you heat aerosol cans, they can like blow up or explode or something. I don't really know, I haven't had experience. But I use this, this is just a roll on one. It's just the Lavera Natro Cosmetic Deodorant with Organic Orange and C Buckthorn. Never heard of that before. Um, doesn't have alcohol, paraben free apparently. It's vegan and it's 24 hour. 
So there you go. Use that as well, just in case I need to top up and be a bit more fresh. That is in my writing bag. Here's a halter and a lead rope. So typically I only use this for like Winston because he's my baby and that's kind of the only horse I'll use it for. It's just a blue navy Roma halter with like fleece parts and I just have a plain navy lead rope attached to it and I have that in there just in case I can't get access to one while I'm at the stables I have my own one. Kind of it. So thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Freshen up the content a little bit, create something a little bit different and I always have my phone in my bag too. Um, but yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you next week for hopefully a riding video or something closer to do with horses. I have also been uploading heaps of videos on my second channel, so I'll pop up a card right now. If you'd like to click on that, you can go see some. Um, so if you'd like to see any more content from me. But yeah, I'll say goodbye to you now. Bye. Oh, there we go.